Welcome to day zero of Free Concord's Occupied Chicago, the NATO Summit protest tapes. This is Dewey Square you're looking at Wednesday evening on May 16th. This is Thursday morning after we had spent the night at a rest stop. Our bus had broken down, a new bus came and picked us up, and we had no idea how we were getting to Chicago from there. That afternoon we learned that the nurses union would be flying us out, so everyone began consuming their valuables that were not TSA approved. You can tell who the true activists are, the first ones to get up. Yeah, we get the complaints about it. Okay. Yeah, we get the complaints about it. 
we had to come over here and go through this whole process. I said, no big deal, get your bus, you need to get your bus, and that's it. I appreciate that you guys aren't choosing to ticket or cage anybody today. In this clip, we're trying to figure out the logistics of the people who won't be able to fly because they don't have state ID. We were eventually able to get bus tickets for them, and they made their way out safely. I just TSA proofed all my stuff and went through it. Like, all right, this needs to go in this bag. I'll say I got the two people that had no photo IDs, as well as two people that. Uh, yeah, I'll just say something and then uh, basically that then you know they need some kind of transportation. But but I don't know if you can get you to twelve o'clock because it's eleven thirty. It's eleven thirty right now? Right. Yeah. And what did you say the bus was one? It was leaving? One fifty or at least at twelve fifteen. Oh, from Boston, Chicago? Yeah. Twelve fifteen? After that there's, there's two more today, but they're at like they're at like, I don't know, like seven and ten or something. Oh man. At this time, Metro is not planning to close any of its system-wide rail lines during the week of May 13th through May 21st, except for the electric line. The BNS this was the subway advisory put out for the weekend of the NATO schedules. summit. But Metro is advising riders to anticipate delays. While service is scheduled to remain the same, Metro, Metro riders taking the train between May 19th and May 21st will be subject to enhanced security restrictions, similar to airports. According to Metro 1, riders may be subject to search and or screening before boarding or while en route. 2. Riders may, on, may carry only one bag not exceeding 15, inch, 15 inches square and 4 inches deep. Boxes, parcels, luggage, backpacks, and bicycles will not be allowed on trains. Banned items cannot be stored at Metro set stations. They must be removed or they will be disposed of. 3. Riders may not carry any food on the trains. Liquid and personal effects, such as makeup, must be less than three ounces in size. This includes coffee and other beverages. Breast milk may be, can be carried, but is subject to inspection and should be declared during any screening. Four, riders may not carry any type of tools, pipes, stakes, wood, or weapons, including pocket knives and pepper spray on the trains. Five, law enforcement personnel must identify themselves and present their credentials and any weapons. Security guards will not be allowed to carry any weapons on board. Failure to comply with these safety measures or instructions from law enforcement personnel or attempted avoidance of screening will result in ejection from the station or further police action. So it sounds like considering a lot of the luggage that people have bringing food with them that we're probably not going to be using the subways much while we're in Chicago. Yeah, walking footing it, walking places. 